Okay, here we are at uh, 2015 County Road 24, Marengo, in southern Morrow County. This is a new listing of mine. A uh, big house uh, with a barn and a shop, and we're on 55 acres. Uh, quite, a, quite a nice property, so let's go on in and uh, take a peek. Okay, so we got the gates open. Let's go on up. We got cornfields on both sides of us, and uh, the Alum Creek, uh, excuse me, Big Walnut Creek, uh, goes along the right side of the property here. You can't see it right now, but we'll take a look later on. Let's uh, keep on going up the driveway and uh, pull on up to the house here. I'll be right back. Oh, hey, wow, take a look at this. An all-brick home, over 3,000 square feet, uh, two bedrooms and a bath upstairs, and we've got three more bedrooms and two baths on the main level, and then we've got another bathroom on the lower level, and uh, fully finished uh, lower level with a two-car attached garage underneath. I'd say there's about uh, 20 to 25 acres out front and another 20 to 25 acres in the back. In the back it's mostly wooded and I'll give you a better view from the deck upstairs in a little while. So at this point let's go on inside. Okay so there's the front steps going up to the front of the house and then this is the uh, south end. Uh, big sunroom up there and uh, two garage doors uh, up to the patio in the back and then check out the uh, rear view here going all the way back uh, into uh, the woods and the Big Walnut Creek is on our right hand side. You can't see it here but it borders the south end of the property. Okay let's uh, continue on up the steps on the front patio here and uh, go on inside and take a look. It's a beautiful sunroom over here on the right end. We'll take a look at that in a second. Okay we're in now into the front foyer with uh, ceramic tile flooring uh, looking into the dining area with fireplace uh, this is not uh, pergo or laminate floor this is an engineered hardwood floor and as we come around here these French doors go out to that sunroom I talked about and as we turn around here's the new kitchen brand new kitchen everything's new cupboards counters dishwasher so on look at the slide out uh, pantry uh, drawers there pantry cupboards here's for a double oven and we come out of the kitchen, go back across the front hallway. This is a home office or it could be a fifth bedroom. And uh, back down the hall here, this door to the right goes down the basement. We'll go down there in a minute. Uh, this hallway to the right goes to the upstairs. We'll go up there in a minute. And first you come through here, there's a full bath with a uh, walk-in shower with, again, ceramic tile uh, in the shower, throughout the shower, not a fiberglass uh, uh, enclosure, engineered laminate flooring in bedroom one, six panel um, pine doors throughout, hardwood flooring in here, all new windows throughout the whole home, uh, insulated double pane windows of course, we turn around and head back out, the front hallway, now let's make a turn and go upstairs. Okay, we get up to the uh, top of the stairs here. And we have two large bedrooms. Here's uh, bedroom number one with a good sized clothes closet and then storage closet down below that took advantage of the eave space. And then there's another bedroom over here with a big walk-in closet. This one measures about oh, eight by eight or so. French doors out to the deck outside. Another large closet over on this side, that's about probably uh, 8 by 10 or 6 by 10. And then a full bath in here. And I don't have all the lights on, but you've got the uh, jacuzzi style whirlpool tub and uh, both his and hers sinks and beautiful cabinet work and countertop. And a walk in shower, glass enclosed, ceramic tile. A beautiful shower for the master bath and we come back out here out to the master bedroom and turn and head back down toward the basement okay let's head down the basement here and again this is a full ceramic tile flooring hit the light switches there we go and there's a big uh, big table here but you can see a full masonry uh, hearth over there for a fireplace insert or you can open it up and make it into a wood burning fireplace once again 
and the baser just turns around and goes to the other end of the house. Sliding doors over there for a clothes closet. Let's go out this door over here. I believe this is the garage. Well, unfortunately, I can't find the light switches for the garage, but it is a two car garage, uh, concrete block walls on both sides. Okay, let's turn around, come back into the basement, and we'll go down to the other end, check out the other end of the basement. Follow me. Okay, so down at this end of the basement, we have a continued uh, ceramic tile flooring. Uh, here's the furnace in a uh, furnace closet. You can see how new that is and how quiet it is. Boy, we can barely hear it running. There's a uh, laundry sink there, and uh, this room uh, can be a closet. Uh, it can be a home office, not suitable for a bedroom, of course, but it's about, uh, oh, 10 by 10 or so. And then uh, in here is a full bath uh, with a large uh, full-size tub, vanity, new stool, and your laundry hookup is right there on the wall. Okay, and back down to this end is a storage. I know it's got to be hard to see in here, but in behind this wooden shelf is a, a wine rack. And that wine rack goes all the way around down to the corner and uh, up the other side. And that's in this, uh, in this closet here, concrete floor, so it stays nice and cool for the wine. There's another storage closet back in the back. If you'd like to take a tour of this property, a personal tour, uh, give me a call now at 419-947-4004. Again, this is 2015 County Road 24, Marengo, Ohio. This property is on 50 acres, but we'll split off some of the land if you don't uh, have a need or desire for a full 50-acre uh, parcel. Look at that in the back. Isn't that pretty? Give me a call. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Here's a view of the rear off the back patio. And as I scan over to the right, where the grass stops and the tall foliage starts, that's where the uh, Big Walnut Creek is over there.